Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Laura with Stitch with Laura. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody is having a great Tuesday. Well, today is Floss Tube Day. So, welcome if you're new here and welcome if you're old here. Thank you for returning. Well, today is my 221st Floss Tube. Today is March 26, 2024. This month is almost over. I don't know what happened. I, I really, really, really don't. Yeah. <sighs> it, it was a week last week. We had snow. We had wind. We had surprise openings. Um, we did have some reviews and just a few starts. And the starts outweighed what I totally worked on. Like older things that I worked on. Yeah, so where to begin? I guess we'll just start at the beginning and go from there. I do have my March cup. And today I'm having orange cinnamon tea. From, is it Twinings? T-W-I-N-G. Twine. T-W-I-N-I-N-G-S. Twinings. So let's start at the top of this pile, shall we say. So the first start that I had was in this pile, not in any particular order. This is the Oriental Tulip, and I started on this side, which is kind of covered up. So it is from Joy Sunday and a 14 count. I was into 14 count this weekend. I don't know, my finger didn't wear out until Sunday, yeah, and then I just couldn't stitch anymore. So all we got done was that little part up in that corner. Yep. Because by the time I got to this, uh, I was like, yeah. I was done on Monday. Yeah. I just, I had jammed my finger so many times with the needle. Over it. Yep. All right. And I don't remember who that came from. Oriental, Oriental. It came from Biggest Craft. Next in the pile is the Ancient Woman and the Dragon from Fan Cells. Didn't get any more of it done either. Yep. And I'm not sure where we started. Probably up here in the Dragon somewhere. Or in this corner. I I'm not sure. Yeah, that was like last week, so what can I say? And it's not very big. Well, I guess it is big enough, right? It's 39 by 74. So, I'm trying to feel where I started. So we started down... I'll just fold that. In about the middle with this dark color. I think it was... Uh, oh, I could be wrong. I want to say it was 823, but not for sure. Or 825. I don't know, it's not as dark as 823, so, yeah, didn't get back to that either. Just put that there in the middle. And the next in my pile came from VIP Cross Stitch, and we're calling him Peter Rabbit, too, because he's got the little jacket on. They have a whole... I don't want to say it's set. It's kind of a grouping, shall we say. Because some of them are, what do you call it? Like Easter oriented. But they have rabbits. They have cats. They have, I think there was a squirrel and a deer. Nothing screams Easter like an Easter deer. They do this and it's like, it's like the Christmas thing with the dragon that was all dressed up for Christmas. Seriously, people, you're just taking it a little too far. So, I'm trying. Goodness gracious. So, we started in that upper right-hand corner, as usual. I say as usual, because nine out of ten times, yeah. So, I just got that much done. 
I was working on those. I think we decided they were hawthorn berries. Yeah, didn't get any further. Some of these will stay out next week. And some, not so much. I don't know, I'm kind of disappointed with the uh, ancient woman with the dragon. I thought there were going to be way more turquoise, so I'm just going to have to get out colors and just sit down and figure out what's what. But I thought it was going to have a whole bunch more uh, colors. Uh, turquoise type colors. Turquoise teal color. I don't know, because that's the way the picture looked. Alright, so next in the pile, this is from Biggest Craft as well. It was the Biggest Craft week. So this is my pink peony in peony in full bloom is what it says. And I've been saving this one for spring. So I got some of that leaf done. And down here I got into that pink flower. So I just picked the darkest pink that they had available and and just started in. Yeah. That's as far as I got on that one. Hang in there, guys. I'm trying to get everything put back where it came from. But crap happens around here. Alright. So, second to last one is Amsterdam. And it came from Biggest Craft as well. Yeah, I just... Okay, so for the video, I was in this building here. Well, I decided to move over and into this section right here. And it was going so well, I didn't want to stop. Hang on. There's the threads in there sideways instead of up and down with the bag. We're having fun now. Oh, come out of there, please. So, I finished off that thread on that oh, crap. light part. Let me get the dumb needle out of the way. We're working on it. We're working on it. So, I was up. Where the hell is it? It's such a light color. It's right up in here. You can barely see it. And I jumped down here and started working on that building. So, I made quite a bit of progress with that. So, I was pretty happy about that. I, I'm really liking that one. I can actually see it. It's not scary. And no, I'm not touching the sky for a while. Yeah, we're just going to stay away from that. Trust me. The sky, it I couldn't tell. there. It looks like there's two, two symbols there. And I can't differentiate, which I know that's not right. Dif, differentiate. You know the word. Yeah. Between the two, so it was just too much for my little scatterbrain. So then in the middle of the week-ish, uh, on the 18th, I guess that was Monday. So I got, along the river during the Qingming Festival from uh, AliExpress. And I started on this side. So, yeah. Don't expect, like, half of that to be done, because that won't be happening for a hot moment. So, I have it down here on the floor. Okay, so, there it is, all rolled up, folded on one part, and, yeah. So, I'll just pick it up, and let me get that needle out of the way. So, I've been working on this corner. Oh, the trees actually look better in the picture. So, I'm working my way across. I thought, well, I'll just work from here, and then I'll just work all the way down and finish that. And no. So, well, okay, I'm over one. Well, I'll just go a little bit for, yeah. So, I was going to try to finish this red. There's two symbols right in there. Actually, three where the light part is, there, that's the third symbol. But there's two red symbols. Not real hard to read. So, it's coming. It's coming. Yeah. Very slowly, but it's coming. So, I had stitched and stitched and stitched. I jammed the needle into 
this part of my finger. Yeah, I was done. Monday. Came too soon. Whoa. So that is, whoa. All the starts. Let me put that back. And what I've done, this is the one that is going to go with the canvas. So this is like one full set of the thread. The other one has its own bag. It says the same thing on the front of it. Except it says extra thread. I was panicking. I was doing number six. And I'm like, I'm almost down number six. I know there's got to be more of that. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. So, we're making progress slow, but sure. I mean, it's pretty easy stitching. It's just bigger areas than some of the others. I don't know. I fled. I've been fleeing between it and the 14 counts. So, I don't know which one's worse in my brain. 14 count was definitely worse. So, it's like I don't want to do a big area. I want to make some progress. You know, I tried, guys. I tried. Yeah, a week into it, and that's all I got. All right. On with what we had been working on. So, this is Riverside... Riverside Building Night Moon, I think is what it, it said it was called. So, I'm about even right in here. That, that's where I've been concentrating. Hang on, got to put it back in its thing. I love this canvas. So, then I'd get this out, and I'd stitch, you know, two or three colors. And yeah. So it was the battle of the 14 count and the big the big things. So, God, it's a, hang on. We're just going to cut it down because my arms are not that long. So, I've been trying to get it over there so you can start to see things in the building. Didn't work anymore on the, uh, the trees over there. That looks so much more... Well, I guess it is kind of done-ish. Okay. So, you know, I go over here and do some of the trees. Then I come back over here and do the same five colors that make up all this for the majority of it. Yeah. But I really, really, really love this. So I haven't gone any further down. Just... Filling in the blanks. Filling in the blanks, guys. But I, I still love it. I adore it. I'm just going to keep all the, those. The 14 counts out. And and these two big ones. I'll kind of... What do you call it? Go in between them. Let's see. I also worked on this one. And it was from DP Clubs. It's called Lovers in the Garden. And I started on, sorry, this side and about got this like triangle done. I started, I had to look and see what the black was going to look like. So I got out some black. I didn't want to do the big areas because, you know, that it, yeah, it is what it is. So, I started putting the black around the edges. Am I upside down again? It goes this way. I'm so sorry. So, there's that corner. But it's really going to look cool with that black. I didn't want to start that part coming up and down. Wasn't into it. So, trying to still put everything and all the leaves that are in there and then finish that. There's a border where this green is. So there's a border there, and then there's a space in between, and then where it's orange is all going to be black and outlined. So, yeah. So, it's coming right along. I really like it. And we got one more, guys. Didn't work on hardly a thing this week. It's if I can get it out. Holy cow. My thread is a nightmare. Hold that thought. There will be a moment, please. Dum, 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 dum. Yeah. So, it is the cat and fish. 
two cats and two fish equal cats and fish. I don't even ask anymore. So here we are. And I've been working on this side right in here. I never got back to the cat again. So, yeah. But it's tiny. But it is full coverage, it, I think. Let me look at it again. I might lie. Oh, it might have some open area, but right in there, there's... Yeah. Okay, it's a partial. Okay, right here. That's it. Open. The rest of it is full coverage. But I really like working on it. I like working with the greens. So, very nice. But that, guys, is everything that I either started, worked on, or got. Yeah, I like the beast, but I just... I don't know how to say it. I've got to be in the mood, in a way. I want to stitch on it. I look at it, and I'll stitch and stitch and stitch. And thank God it's 11 count. That's all i got to say. I'd have lost my mind a long time ago. But it does have some bigger areas. So I'm kind of going to areas where there's more than one color, like that red part at the top that I showed you. Yeah. Just so... It breaks up the monotony of stitching back and forth and back and forth. Other than that, guys, I think that's it. I, I think we got it all. Yep. As for this week, I haven't got a clue. I don't know if the mailman will bring me anything to review or not. I can't count on them. Not a clue. Not a clue. Um, we will have one more March. March, Saturday, and then next weekend, not this one coming up, the one after that, will be April, and it will be animals. You can stitch on ant real animals or fantasy animals, but animals. So, get it, your animals ready for April, and that'll be April, Saturday stitching. And, of course, we'll have the Soothing Sunday thing. I kind of like that. I tried this weekend. I thought, I'll make one that's an hour. It wouldn't even let me put it in the edit thing. So that I could add the music to it. I had to scrap the whole thing. I thought afterward, I thought, darn, I should have just uploaded. Well, I know how to upload it from my phone into YouTube. But the problem was going to be putting all the music in, and I don't know that I can or can't do that um, via just YouTube. Because I use, I think it's called YouTube Create, is what the editing thing is. We know that, but evidently there wasn't enough space, and that lovely little uh, storage card that I got, I... It has 140-some gigabytes on it, and I can't figure out why I'm out of room. So, I don't know. We, we may never get an hour, hour video out of me. Yeah, because I don't have a camera. A camera camera that is capable of all that. So, yeah. That's where we're at, guys. Alright guys, I think that's about it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and please hit the bell. That way you'll know when my next video comes out. Stay safe, stay healthy. We'll see you next time. God bless. Bye bye. Keep stitching.